make sure you guys go subscribe to Hoodie CED. You guys never seen him on the channel. First link in the description to his channel. What's up, YouTube? So today, I'm going to be teaching y'all a quick and easy, like, VC method. It's kind of like an AFK method. This video ain't going to be too long. I'm going to get straight into it. So first, what you want to do is make a new player. It don't matter what type of player you make them, what build. You're not going to be doing them with this player. You don't have to upgrade them, give them no badges. So just make a random player. I'm going to get back at y'all when I finish this player. So as y'all can see, I just finished making a random build. Now um, you just want to press start my career. Once you press start my career, it's going to make you join a team. You don't want to join just know any team. You want to join a team that you know not going to make the playoffs. I picked the Orlando Magic. You could pick whoever you want. So once you do that, you just going to skip through the whole regular season. When you skip through the regular season, it's going to ask you, are you sure you want to end the season? You press yes. Now, when you press yes, it's going to show the playoff awards. Just skip all that. I'm going to get back at y'all when I skip all this. Now, as y'all see, I skipped all that. So, once you skip all that, it's going to say something about joining free agency. You just want to press yes. You want to join free agency. Once you join free agency, you just want to go to a team. And no matter what team you go to, just go to a team. So for me, I pick the temple. So when you pick the team, the coach is going to talk to you. He's going to talk about a contract or offer. So what you want to do is you want to minimize your minutes, your years, and your bonus. So then you want to raise your VC up from anything to 720 to 750. He might decline your offer or give you a new offer. I put 750. He said he couldn't do that. So he gave me 720 and I accepted it. So once you accept that, they're going to put you on a little loading screen and then they're going to let you join the team. So once you join the team, it's going to say something about a brand. You just pick your brand or whatever and play your first game. When you play your first game, you got to play as bad as possible. Run out of bounds, shoot full court shots, leave your minds open. Your goal is to get an F team in grade. When you get an F team in grade, just follow up. So, like, another thing y'all could do is y'all could do this in My Player Nation, and y'all can get more VC. So, as y'all can see in this clip right here that's playing, you're going to get zero my points, zero VC, and zero all that. We ain't worrying about that. Our goal is to get five minutes. So after that first game of playing bad, you're going to come to the main meet and you're going to check your minutes and see that you still have 10 minutes. When I'm on 10 minutes, we want 5. I'm going to show y'all why later in the video. But since y'all still have 10 and we want 5, y'all want to go play another game like that, get an F and run out of bounds. You're going to only have to do this two times maximum. So once you played that game, got an F and fouled out, it's going to give you 5 minutes. Once it give you 5 minutes, go into a game. And go AFK. Do whatever you want. Shoot four court shots. Get on your phone. Leave your homework. Do whatever you want. No matter what you do, you're going to get 720 VC. That's a good amount considering that you're only playing five minutes or less. Most likely, you're going to only play four minutes. So, that's the end of this video. Um, You keep spamming it. You can do it over and over again. I'm going to be coming out with a free tattoo glitch in my next video. I'm going to be coming out with more VC methods. I'm going to come out with a glitch, too. Um, I'm going to be doing how to grind your badge points, finishing, playmaking, shooting, defensive rebounding, all that. So if y'all want to see the videos, turn on post notifications.